Hey guys, so in this video, I am going to share with you what are my favorite colors to use when I paint with watercolors. My most favorite color is marine blue and all these paints uh, that I'm going to show you here in this video are by Holbein. So these are going to be the names that Holbein uses for their watercolors. If you need pigment numbers, I have a list of them on my website as well. Marine blue pretty much goes with every aqua color that I can think of. I usually mix it with turquoise blue and occasionally I will add cobalt green which is also in my group of to-go colors when I paint any water scenes. Next color I choose a lot is Viridian Hue but Holbein also has a pure Viridian color as well. This color really goes well with marine blue but also with uh, cobalt green or turquoise blue. I use this color a lot when I paint boats and when I need shadows underneath the boat. I will often mix Viridian with uh, indigo for example to darken the shadows up a bit and here you have an example of when I add indigo color to the mix with marine blue and turquoise blue to the right. My second darkest color I use a lot apart from indigo is Payne's Gray. Payne's Gray and Indigo are very similar. Indigo is just more bluish and Payne's Gray more grayish. Uh, but I mix these two a lot when I paint night skies, water, or when I paint animals. I use these for example to paint eyes. I think Indigo goes really well with Burnt Sienna. Burnt Sienna is that reddish brown color and I use it a lot and I like to mix it with other tones, not just indigo or Payne's Grey, but it goes really well with yellow okra or sap green or even olive green. This color is called Imidazalone Brown and it's a really nice warm shade of brown. Uh, to me, it looks like a burnt orange color. I love adding it to my browns, sepia or even green. Next one up is sepia. I feel like it's just a very dark brown with a bit of black in it. I mix it with pretty much all of my colors and here I am mixing it with imidazolone brown. Now I am going back to indigo because indigo, which is very dark blue, mixes very well with greens. So in a second I am going to mix it with two of my favorite green colors. First one, sap green and then olive Green. To make your own olive green color, you can just add a very tiny amount of black and red to your green. And now I am adding burnt sienna to mix it with olive green. Mars Violet is like blue-red or even blue-violet color. I use it quite a bit when I paint flowers. It goes really well with greens like olive green um, and I use it to create shadows for my petals like rose petals. Um, then there is Carmine. Carmine is a very deep red and I recently just used it to paint pomegranates. Uh, then Rose Mother, my next favorite color. Rose Mother is most commonly used to describe the color made from the mother lake pigment. In my opinion, it is more on a transparent side. Another color I like a lot is Crimson Lake. It's a reddish purple color and it goes really well with Mars Violet or Rose Mother Carmine.
I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching.